That's the Mutra River Flats out in front of us here. Yeah, how important are they to the local economy? They mean everything to the local economy. They're the life bread of the, the area. Where will the mine be? The mine is just straight in front of us up on the plateau. What we're standing in, should the mine go ahead, will be a hole in the ground about 40 metres deep. And this mine is also only 350 metres from the Mitchell River, which is part of the Ramsar list of Gippsland Lakes. So we're talking about tourism and we're talking about food. And food is fundamental to, to this economy. These people aren't a mining company. They're professional gamblers who make a living by parasitising off community. How good is mining? That's what we say. Do you even know how many people are going to be listening to your mess for the rest of their good life? Do you care? Oh, my, my community suffered terribly. At least six families had to sell out to the mining company because they couldn't cope any longer. We had, we had people, couples, on the verge of divorce because of the stress. We both stood there looking over the edge of this grey haze coming off this monazite. A million dollars later, they carted the crap out. This is after it blew all over my house yard that I was to walk back into one day with my family and live happily ever after. Because it'll fall on the taxpayers to do rehabilitation, if ever. Suddenly you realise that your farm's not your farm anymore. It um, can be impacted by an outside effect like a sand mine and uh, can turn your life upside down. We might not be able to live here. Well, where do we live and who pays for where we live? Do we have to sell? My vote around the table actually counts. Take that back! I've got a lot to say, thank you, and you can all be quiet while I say it. Councillors, I respectfully request that you consider your legal position. If I knew what I know now, I would have gone to jail over it. I would have spoken up. I would have done everything to stop it. It was a disgrace. We must counter those noisy voices which want to shut you down. Don't believe the words they tell you because they're just hollow empty words to make the exploration company worth millions so they can sell on to somebody else. That's their driver, is personal wealth. There's been more tears in this room, believe me. It's just not fair.